Hello, uh, it's this guy again, the one that doesn't sp uh, stop spamming on Reddit and sacredly asking you for subscribe. But eh, whatever. YouTube is not, uh, I'm not even a partner of YouTube, I need a thousand subscriber and looks like there's not too many of us that like this hobby or I'm just suck at making videos. That's probably my case here. Well, I've been uploading videos, I mean, these photos of my haul and everything, and this looks pretty well. Just like this. Yeah, that looks horrible. Well, wow, the illumination is going crazy. Um, this is the LEDs that I install. I'm gonna put some links in the description. Also, um, I'm just gonna let you know how I install these LEDs on these defaults. So, these ones are called. Maybe a text over here, if I'm not too lazy. Uh, also, these models are from IKEA. And this is gonna appear the name right here, I guess. These are around $30. And for the this model of case, it's around this quantity, because I didn't did my research, and then I'm gonna have to do a lot of work on the post-production and well uh, the one in the middle basically I got it from a garage sale it originally was black hopefully my future self is gonna put a picture around here of the original color and it's just gonna look how it was before it was painted black I mean what whatever so these LEDs came with this control, totally excessive because I only lose, I only use a white. But if you wanna cause a seizure to your to your figurines, God damn it, I need to be like super close. Wait, no, out. There we go. So if you wanna lose all style, yeah, you can go go ahead and have a freaking disc over here. I'm just gonna shut down this light. I mean, it's not ideal. I I just like the white because it's create a better illumination and it makes look everything more cleaner, everything more bright and you can check that the illumination basically is perfect for photo shoots and whatever it, it might be a, a little bit way too blue or white but you can check whatever color you like here so you want something more warmer or if you want to go completely Miku <laughs> okay that's way too much so we're, we're just gonna keep it white so with these LEDs also, they came with um, with different levels of brightness. So basically you can pick the brightness of the intensity of the LEDs. So you can see these ones are still on. But yeah, you can control with one of these part of the shelves. But if you try to do something like this, you need to point and that's what it happened. You try to, yeah, you see that. So I came with a nifty solution. Basically, what I did, I connect those uh, outlets, Wi-Fi outlets that you can control with your app. I'm gonna put a video right here. So. What I like of this is basically the white likeness and also because another guy from reddit I don't remember your name but a stranger guy from reddit thank you very much but let's go and see the installation over here so for the LED that I use this is the whole kit normally you can just get like this piece or only this piece or wherever the the control is named so it says basically just um, remove the double tape and try to put it your best. 
So here, since this is the left shelf, I just try to hide it to the left. So when you enter the room, you are not able to see anything from here, just this little spot. So this is the the start of the LED. God damn it. So that's the start of the LED. This is the sensor for the control. This is the start. And that's the white thing I mean. So like I was saying basically this came with an adhesive on the back. So you just strip the adhesive and then just go all the way up. One recommendation is basically just to move the this panel to the back so you have enough space. And also you wanna install install them after this metal here so it doesn't create any shadow and you can tell that no matter what angle your angles are really nice with them with illumination ah, what, a, what about jobs or all that so another recommendation here is that here in the corners you don't want to create a lot of tension here in this corner because the adhesive is not gonna stay because this pressure here on the corner are just gonna push the lead strip and then it's gonna go away from the adhesive so the adhesive is just gonna start falling and you're gonna start finding your case like this so basically I'm not expert with lead so that's why I pay around $20 for this set it came with the lead itself the control the connectors over there uh, with the AC you can purchase all of these separately and if you know a little bit of LED you probably could get a better set But I didn't want to waste a lot of time and even if you get the pieces From one to another you are going to basically get like um, Maybe not so good price because unless you dedicate to install this kind of stuff it's not worth it. So just go grab uh, the one for 20 bucks and install them. So yeah, if you put a lot of pressure here, it's gonna start doing this kind of stuff because it's gonna try to lose the tension over here. So it's gonna start doing this. So right now I think I got that fixed. And this is what happened. Fuck. So yeah. Uh, something like that. Don't be afraid. The, the HACP is pretty good. Uh, basically, the, the box screen with came with extra uh, double tape double face tape whatever it's called I don't know so basically you connect this to electricity and then you connect the AC cord to this little white thing the DC plug controller this is the thing that controls everything this is the sensor and this is what powered the LED and that's it so yeah uh, the LEDs came every like one, two, three, one, two, three. Every three LEDs, there's this connection. There's even an icon in the middle that says cut here. So when you finish, to go all the way around, you just need to cut where it's designed to cut. And it happened sometimes, not all the time. That is gonna be ending there, and that's pretty helpful. I cut that myself. So don't be afraid to install them. The lead strip already came with a with an adhesive, but it also came with a few extra strips. So if you need to like glue anything or whatever. So yeah, and. Um, for the future probably I'm just gonna put more LEDs here, I don't like this light I think it's... even it's a LED right there, I don't like how it looks You can appreciate like there's a black hole in the middle But I already did a test with the LEDs and it looks really nice Also... Uh, the link came with 5 meters or I don't know how many feet but you're gonna have this left over from each 
each one of the sets but I'm thinking of getting more little parts and maybe another white thing that you saw over there in the bottom one of these oops one of these over here and install them over here inside so I can replace that those lights and control everything with my smartphone and since I don't want any other color because nobody needs another color you can just basically stay like that and turn it on turn it off and it looks pretty good but hey if your vibe is I don't know pink just go ahead have it pink I mean yeah I mean no don't don't please don't just just stay with, <laughs> with good illumination let's see what I can do stupid country come on flash I mean you can do a lot of stuff with this set but it doesn't mean that you have to do it so, so please please try, try not to it's like too, too many options are okay but sometimes it's just like no, no. So yeah, also uh, a few people on Reddit was asking me if the LED will damage the PVC or the ABS. Like in my last video, I tell them that the, basically in a lot of figurines, the the legs are ABS and the the, the upper part is PVC because it's lighter. Anyway, both of those materials can be damaged by UV lights. Also, they can be damaged by the heat. So, this little LED right here doesn't emit any UV light, neither heat. So, your figurines are just gonna be really nice and pretty. Just look at this. I'm not even making an effort to do... Uh, <laughs> as you guys you can appreciate. A uh, good job with the camera. But this thing's just looking awesome. And this is... How it looks with a normal normal light it doesn't look that good because it creates this horrible this looks better but meh, it could look better yeah I've been looking a lot of uh, different LEDs and to be honest these are the easiest one to install you're gonna be able, probably able to find something like for ten dollars or something like that. But you're gonna miss. You're you're always going to miss one piece. Maybe it doesn't come with a controller, or it's only one light. And I decided to pick this one because it was faster, because it it, it has already everything. And I'm my freaking lazy guy. So, but hey. Uh, I might not have time for a lot of stuff, but I'm trying to do my best here. Um, I think I, I need to do better. <laughs> well, whatever. So yeah, there you have it. And when you're finished here, you can just light up and come back to reality. But anyway, let's go back to <laughs> that reality. But yeah, guys, um, I know it's a little bit long video. So I'm just gonna try to separate them. No, I'm just lying. You will have to watch like 20 minutes of me talking and trying to figure out the answer that I could have you answer in 10 seconds. But no, no. But what are we gonna do, right? Well, guys, see you around. Take care. And if you cringe, please subscribe. Thank you. Now, yeah, well, one more thing. Um, by the way, somebody noticed the. Uh, while I was editing, somebody noticed that uh, these defaults, defaults or whatever the fuck they're called, they are about ground. Uh, I did these because I want them to be at the same level at the main display here. So, what I did was... Mm, let, let me go to the other one. Oh, that's a little piece of lead. Come on, focus. So, 
And basically what I did was I create a frame by 2 by 4 Yeah, this is not the, like the best job ever, but <laughs> I'm not a carpenter or whatever So I painted white, the same white as this one And then I made these screws over here These are deck, deck screws and this way if you are really into this kind of thing it's really cool because with this one I was actually able to hide that thing over here and that's it yeah it looks horrible when you are really near but it looks awesome when you are like this and the main focus point basically are three greens. <laughs> 